Hi guys! Are you one of aspiring international students in Canada and you have a background in information technology? Whether it's in your career or in your education and you don't know which program to take in Canada, then this video is for you. Please keep on watching. I will be listing down program recommendations specifically created for aspiring students with background in information technology or anything related to computer. If you are new to my channel, my name is Catherine and I'm an education counselor from Canada Education and I'm here to give you some tips and insights on how to become an international student in Canada. Please don't forget to like this video and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so it will help the YouTube algorithm spread this video to all other aspiring international students. program this is called graduate certificate in information technology solutions offered at Humber College which is located in Toronto Ontario now in this program you will be introduced to the basic concepts of software development database concepts and of course web development now Humber College accepts applicants who are not graduate of information technology or anything related to computer but of course you must have an experience in IT or any um, department you are working as a computer systems technician maybe or an IT support you will gain basic knowledge about the computers and some database development and administration now this program will cost you around 18,500 Canadian dollars per year which doesn't include ancillary fees or other miscellaneous fees I will make a video about ancillary fees what does it entails or what is included in the ancillary fee so we will learn more about the extra cost you will pay once you get to Canada Humber College waives IELTS requirements for Filipinos however there are a certain list of schools from where you graduated from in the Philippines wherein they will waive the IELTS requirements I hope I was able to explain that correctly okay so with this program after you finished it you could get or land a job as a software developer so for our next program this is called graduate certificate in information technology infrastructure offered at Fanshawe College located in London Ontario now this program will focus on the practices and skills used in supporting the IT infrastructure such as the Windows and Linux operating systems, Windows Server administration, virtualization technologies, and network and security devices. I feel like I'm talking in a different language because I don't understand any of these. I am not a graduate of IT so I hope this makes sense to you guys. Anyway, you will have a hands-on application and simulations to provide students with marketable skills in operating systems, network, and security. Now, a possible work for you after you finish this program is security management specialist or network engineer or architect. Now, this program will cost you around 15,000 Canadian dollars per year and is offered as a one-year graduate certificate. Now, Fanshawe College offers a bundle program wherein you can apply for a two programs with one LOA. So if you're looking to get a three-year postgraduate work permit, then you can definitely apply at Fanshawe College and get a two program with one LOA. So for our next program, this is called Post-Degree Diploma in Business Management Major in Information Technology offered at Northern Lights College located in Fort St. John in British Columbia. And for this program, in order to be eligible to apply, you must hold a bachelor's degree in Information Technology or Computer Science. So you must have a basic knowledge about computers and information technology because you will be studying mainly about the business management aspect of in the in information technology industry or the tech industries basically you will learn about organizational behavior project management communications and st strategic management specifically applicable to the tech industry and this will help you gain employability in the middle management positions in the tech industry now as we all know northern lights college is one of the low cost tuition fees in british columbia and this program will cost you around eleven thousand. 
Canadian dollars per year. Now, they are accepting applications for January 2023. They opened last February 1. But since this is also a competitive program or highly demand program in Canada as well as the school because they offer a low cost tuition fee. So I hope you guys already submitted your application. Otherwise, you, you must wait for the next available intake. Now, as we all know, since technology keeps on advancing and evolving, it is also prone to threats and attacks. Now, for this next program, it is called Graduate Certificate in Information Technology Network Security offered at Conestoga College located in Waterloo, Ontario. Now, for this program, you will be able to learn about security background in network technologies, to further enhance the systems from attack. Now you will also learn how to identify threats through auditing and supporting technical methods in order to provide a strong support organizational security posture. Now for this program, if you apply in January and you will be finishing around in August and then you can apply for another program since this is a one-year graduate certificate, you can either take graduate certificate in virtualization and cloud computing or in computer applications development which will enable you to apply for a three years postgraduate work permit. Now this program will cost you around 14,500 Canadian dollars not including the ancillary fee. Also Conestoga College has an application fee of 90 Canadian dollars and they are waiving IELTS requirements for Filipinos just as long as you have a certificate of English as medium of instruction from your college. Our next program, this is called Graduate Certificate in Information Technology Majoring in Business Analysis, offered at New Brunswick Community College located in St. John in New Brunswick, which is in Atlantic region. They are also known to provide a low-cost tuition fees for aspiring international students. Now, in this program, you will learn how to be a strategic thinker who will enable change and uh, design a successful operational model that will help the business or your organization to achieve its goals and ensure a long-term prosperity so you will be you will learn how to read data and make um sound decision based on the um, data provided by your company and of course you need to plan manage and monitor any proposed solutions as we all know new brunswick offers a low-cost tuition fees for aspiring international students and this program will cost you nine thousand five hundred canadian dollars per year and that's not including ancillary fees they are also waiving the ielts requirements for filipino students and i know a lot of you guys are eyeing atlantic region to be your place or your province of choice because of the easier PR pathway through the Atlantic Immigration Pilot Program. Now, I am not a migration consultant, so I cannot discuss this AIPP in detail. However, you can check the link down below for more information about AIPP and how you're able to apply uh, for the PR migration through this path. Sure guys, if you are reading articles on which jobs will get obsolete in the near future since not all but most businesses are shifting to automation or robotics and all that artificial intelligence. So some jobs like for example the cashiers are replaced with self-service checkout, even um, cars are being replaced with self-driving kind of feature like with Tesla and all of that. So for our next program, this is called Graduate Certificate in Industrial Automation offered at Niagara College located in Welland, Ontario. Now the curriculum focuses on programmable logistic control, robotics, industrial networks, and project management. So you will have a hands-on learning on Niagara College's high-tech manufacturing and design laboratory. So it sounds exciting because you will learn about robotics and all that automation. So mainly it focuses on the manufacturing side. So could you could be employed as an industrial automation technician or an industrial automation. Now the cost of this program is around 21,000 Canadian dollars per year. So it's kind of costly, actually very costly for this program. It's because it deals with 
automation and robotics. So Niagara College waives application fee if you apply through Kanata Education and of course they waive IELTS requirements for Filipinos and they also offer a 2000 Canadian dollars um, scholarship for their applicants. If you don't know how to apply and if you want to apply in Niagara College then you can just submit your application or inquire on our Facebook page and we will help you apply at Niagara College. For our next program, this is called Graduate Certificate in Network Architecture and Security Analytics offered at Sioux College located in Sault Ste. Marie in Ontario. Now for this program, students will learn to have the skills and knowledge to analyze and design the operation of an enterprise network. I don't know what is an enterprise network means. All I know an enterprise is some sort of a business. I'm, I'm not sure if it means the same in information technology, but anyway, you will focus more on the security and its varying concepts, or I mean varying components that are integral to the multi-layer defense mechanism of an information technology infrastructure or architecture sounds very big to me guys so it is a one-year graduate certificate and you can apply for another one-year program at Sioux College remember they are also giving an entry scholarship of 2,000 Canadian dollars it means you don't have to apply it will be automatically given to you and applied in your letter of acceptance now this program will cost you around 15,900 Canadian dollars per year. Now, Sioux College is located in Sioux St. Marie, which is also part of the RNIP or the Rural and Northern Immigration Pilot Program. So it's also easier for you to apply for a PR pathway should you wish to study in Sioux College. They are also known to have a low cost of living. I believe some of my students are renting rooms in Sioux St. Marie community for around 250 to 300 Canadian dollars. So it's kind of like a steal, guys. So I hope you apply at Sioux College. They are waiving uh, the application fee of 100 Canadian dollars and you can only apply at their school if you do have an agent. So I highly suggest to contact us should you wish to study at Sioux College. So our next program is quite interesting. Graduate Certificate in Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning offered at Lambton College located in Toronto, Ontario. Now, as we all know, everyone or almost all businesses are shifting to digital world or in artificial intelligence or robotics. So I'm not sure if you've heard of Metaverse and um, some companies using artificial intelligence as part of their services or using that to serve their customers. So in this program, you will learn about comprehensive knowledge and skills and training in utilization of artificial intelligence and machine learning. I'm pretty sure this is not offered in the Philippines. So this is a very good program for you guys to explore and to apply to. And since there is a shortage of skilled professionals, since it is a challenge for most businesses who are shifting to AI and uh, machine learning operations. So I believe there is a lot of potential for this program once you finish studying it. And the possible job for this program is business intelligence developer, an AI engineer, and machine learning engineer. So with that words or with that kind of jobs, I think you will earn a lot. Anything that is related to the tech industry, I think those are mostly the high-paying jobs aside from the healthcare industry in Canada. So this is a very good program for you guys. I'm not sure if you've heard of Lambton College. I will be making a separate video about it. They are one of the schools who offered low-cost tuition fees and they are located in Ontario. So if you don't have other options and you want to move to Ontario or chooses Ontario as their study as their province of choice when they study in Canada, then this is a good option for you. I will create a detailed video about it later on. For this program, it will cost you around, of course, since it, it is an artificial intelligence, so anything fancy about computer, it will cost you around 26,000 Canadian dollars, so it's quite expensive. Well, there are other programs offered at Lambton, so we'll discuss more about it later. But 
for this program, it will cost you around 26,370 Canadian dollars per year. So next on our list, it is called Graduate Certificate in Database Application Developer, which is offered at Seneca College located in Toronto, Ontario. When we say database, all I know is about data inputted in Excel. So I'm not sure if it's the same, but coming from a background in business or in um, admin, this is all I know. Anyway, in this program, you will learn how to design, test, and implement databases on a variety of operating platforms. You will also learn how to create database computer applications using web and object-oriented languages. So you guys have a different language in information technology. So throughout this program, students will develop the following skills such as analyze system requirements for application, perform logical database design, web technologies in computer applications, and develop business applications. Also, you will have the chance or the opportunity to complete an optional work term in a formal work environment so that means you will be getting a co-op so i think from all of the programs and schools i've mentioned earlier this is the school or program that has a co-op that is related to information technology now this program will cost you around twenty thousand canadian dollars per year and seneca college also um, collects an application fee of 90 Canadian dollars. However, they do waive IELTS requirements for Filipinos, just as long as, of course, you have a certificate of English as medium of instruction. So last but not the least is graduate certificate in cybersecurity offered at George Brown College located in Toronto, Ontario. And in this program, you will learn the theory and practical skills required to become a cybersecurity professional. You will also learn the differences and similarities between a cybersecurity and hacking. So okay, they, they are different. Uh, this is the first time I've heard about this. Anyway, so you will learn um, the methods and approach used to identify the primary attacks and of course the um, and of course to mitigate potential attacks in your company's um, information technology system network, something like that. Okay, you will also have the capabilities to monitor, assess, and evaluate security risk and threats to physical and digital infrastructure. Now, possible work for you guys who will finish this program are security analyst, security software developer, cryptographer, crypto analysis, and security consultant. Now, this program will cost you around 23000 Canadian dollars per year, and that's not including ancillary fees. IT programs are quite expensive, right? So <laughs> I'm not sure about you, but I think it will be worth it and you will get an ROI from all these expenses once you get employed in Canada. So that's it for today's video, guys. I hope I was able to help you decide on which program and um, school to apply to in Canada. If you don't know how to start with your application, please do send us a message on our Facebook page and we will assist you with your application and walk you through the process of application as an international student in Canada. Always remember, we don't collect any processing fees for our students and we provide free consultation. Just click on the link below and send us a message. Thank you so much guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!